You? you don't look like a guard to me. Because I'm not. Name's Zachariah Manser, lieutenant in Ophir. If you're the merchant who got himself kidnapped from the exchange, I'm here to get you out. I am. I am indeed. Fiorello, master of the caravan. The shadow still protects me. But I doubt you came to help us out of the generosity of spirit. Am I correct in that presumption? Ian Manser, great master of the Technomancers, sent me to talk to you. Ah, I see, yes. One of my favorite clients. And a man with whom I, indeed, have some information to share. Aurora has discovered a new site. Not far from the Shadow Path. A site filled with objects of incredible condition. And even a relic, as rumor has it. News I'm sure the Great Master will be glad to hear. You should go now. Get back on the exchange as quick as you can. I'm not one to dally, Manson. I'll see you around, I'm sure. Come on, guys, let's get him! Doors locked from the other side. Guess we're going around. Come <laughs> on! 
go through here. Can't go through here. Make the slightest move, you're a dead man. The slightest move, you're a dead man. Make the slightest move, you're a dead man. Sorry, pal. That you even... What else? Show. Look what the cat dragged in. The prodigal son. A diamond in the rough risen from poor street trash to the godlike ranks of Technomancer. Now tell me, why am I so lucky to be in your presence? Word is the slums have formed pockets of regime opposition, and you might know where they can be found. People who oppose the regime? I am shocked. Shocked and appalled, and certain of nothing.
Then don't be a snitch. Just stand back and watch as their bombs go off and your precious streets are overrun with guards. I'm sure you're smart enough to know that that can't be good for business, though. You're one smooth talker, Rogue. Clearly smarter than you look. Find the bar, the curiosities, and you'll find what you're looking for. The garden where the seeds of anarchy are sown. Or so I hear. Thank you. I'll go check it out right away. As would I. Just find them before they blow them. Unfortunately, this is beyond my skill level. are close. I need to get closer to hear what they're saying. I just gotta keep this great and stay hidden. Shut up. Someone's coming. the next action going down. You heard anything? Operation Cut's going off in a few hours. Bulgakov's taking care of it. Taking a bomb down to the train station in one of those military bags. With all the troops moving around the area, nobody will even look twice. Fucking regime won't be able to ignore us after that. Freedom or death, right? If they're trying to hit the train station, Lieutenant, we gotta stop them. Do you know how many people they're gonna kill? And we'd be cut off from the other cities and the Burgess's <laughs> enclaves. <laughs> Even the aqueducts would be Lab shut down. Positions. You mean terrorists? Shut Can't that one shut, shut up? Sympathetic to the cause. this newbie. Shut up! What? No. I wouldn't put it that I'm way. Just but yes, David is right. It's better if people, people don't know. Panic. 
Stop with your the bomb check. could end badly for everyone involved. this bag, please. 
It belongs to you? Yeah, I figured. But I was expecting. A man? Sorry to disappoint. But since you're here, minding my business, maybe I should introduce myself. I'm Bulgakov, one of the leaders of the opposition army. You gonna arrest me now? Arrest you and take that bomb before it does any harm to the city. <laughs> you don't have a damn clue, do you, officer? That bomb was never meant for the city. This is our city, too. It was meant to take out the access roads to the city, to block the army convoys. It's time this fratricidal war finally came to an end. You think we're fighting for Aurora? You're wrong, officer. The opposition is made of patriots, and the war we're losing is making the true patriots weaker, while the politicians and their secret police grow stronger. You're no patriot. A patriot would let her voice be heard at the assembly of the people, not set off bombs in the city she claims to love. You couldn't possibly be that naive, could you, officer? Ask around. See if you can find just one person who dared to speak up at your precious assembly and is still around to talk. The only voice ever heard from is the Watchers. The rest are silenced, and will continue to be until only the ASC agents remain. Stay suspicious of me. It's your right. But I don't lie, officer. I'd never hurt the people on purpose. I only ever wanted to free them. Let me. Don't stand in my way, because it's the only road to a better abundance. I'm doing the right thing. Go on. Go! But leave the bomb. And I trust you enough, but not that much. I hear you. Thanks. And goodbye, officer. Beware the watchers. Hi. Lieutenant, how can I help you? Word on the street is that the locusts are swarming the underworks. Patrol gonna get it under control before the shit hits the fan? <laughs> Unlikely. High command's about as interested in the slums as they are the underworks. Why try to spit shine a turd? And what's it to you anyway? As it goes, little nuisances have a way of becoming big problems over time. Proliferation. And I'd be willing to pay to nip it in the bud now, before they start to hit our warehouses and personnel, too. Well, you'd have more luck killing them in their nests than hunting them one by one. Or you could booby trap the tunnels and catch the rats while they roam. Your call. Can I help you? Made the traps you suggested. Now they just have to be set to catch the locusts. And I'll make sure they find their way to the tunnels. Keep the filthy things from reaching the surface and poaching our goods. And Lieutenant, thank you for keeping it your lucky day. I need a favor, if you have the time, on top of the missions the captain already gave you. 
Depends on the soldiers back from the according to it. I would first. I know you'll see pipe down. Lieutenant will find a way. You already back, Lieutenant Zachariah? What's the word on even I don't know. What's the word? Dick. What about Jeff? Jeff. And what if he was understand? What's the word on David? Dick. And what are your thoughts? But if Do you know the No. Do you know it? And what are your thoughts? She's hearing this. And what are their threats? What intel do you have? They're the linchpins of abundance. They head up our under Colonel. What do you know about Colonel? He's a pig. Captain, report. Go ahead, Lieutenant. The insurgency's been quelled. What about this pain in my ass, Bulgakov? Let me start with the good news. We stopped Bulgakov at the station before they set off their explosives. Bad news? She slipped away before we could grab her. Starting with the good news doesn't make it any less of a failure, Lieutenant. The ASC is going to try to rip us a new asshole over this, but the fact that they said Bulgakov was a man and not a woman might give us a bit of ammo to fire back with. I'm still pissed, but there's no telling how many lives you saved today. So go find Quartermaster Ryan and collect your pay. Let's keep the fuck-ups to a minimum, though, going forward. Only so many times I'll be able to cover your ass with the ASC. Captain, report? Yes, Lieutenant. Rest assured, potential scandal's been abolished. Everything's in order. We managed to neutralize most. Some, unfortunately, escaped. Then you didn't act quickly enough. It should have been your priority, Lieutenant. Because of your failures, all we can do now is hope that the word doesn't spread. And what was the fate of the sergeant in charge of the group? Sergeant Boris? You'll be pleased to hear that he's been eliminated, as requested. I'm glad to hear my expectations were met. As hard as it must have been to carry out those orders, it's never easy to take the life of one of your own. Even if he was the quartermaster, has your pay. Good. Moving on. We have new missions. Bit of a welcome change from the big chief. We've got state officials arriving. We've got brigades. Questions, Lieutenant? Captain Eliza told Indeed, I've been
Excuse me, soldier. I wanna... Freeze! Not another step! That uniform ain't fooling anyone, asshole! Look, I just got back from one hell of a mission, so if my uniform's not up to spec, you'll forgive me. But either tell your superiors I'm back with intel, or explain to them why you kept it from them. You just finished spying on the enemy? But why did you say that in the first place? Get in here before your covers blow! Corporal, let's chat. You wanna chat? Sure, why not? It's fine. Listen. Drop. Door's locked from the other side. Guess we're going around. Husband. Yes, I'm Corporal. Ma'am, he's. Tell him I'm. He Corporal, let's chat. You wanna chat? Sure, why not? Not like we're at war here. Let's just have a goddamn tea party. Whatever you wanna chat about. Oh shit, I'm sorry, Lieutenant. I didn't see your stripes. Your uniform threw me off, sir. My mistake. It's fine, Corporal. Stand down. Listen, Corporal, you're confused. You're scared, and I get that. Not a lot is making sense to you now. But you have to trust me. You're back in Ophir. And your wife, Maya, she's worried about you. Maya? How the hell do you know my wife's name? Did you do something to... Your wife's fine, Corporal. She even told me about that ribbon you sent her. She told you about the ribbon? I, I don't... I don't understand. There was a goddamn war raging out there. I heard it. We were under siege. It was. The fighting's done, though. You held the warehouse like men, so just relax and return to your barracks. Rest. Good news. 
best kind. Yes, sir. Fortunately, this is beyond my skill level. 